Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl, T. So I want to come on here and talk about the whole Teriyaki Tina situation, honey. Yes, Teriyaki Tina, a.k.a. Tokyo Tony, is once again going viral all over the blogs for going off on her daughter, Black China. So as you guys all know, if you follow me on Instagram, if you don't follow me, you might as well start following me, honey, okay? So as you guys all know, I posted earlier today this rant that she went on on Instagram. She typed a whole dissertation, honey. Let me go ahead and read to you guys this dissertation that she wrote on the gram. Check this out. So Black China's mama says, you betrayer, you bought that car, or so I thought. Little did I know that weak ass $40,000 minimum, I have three years for it to be paid off, and it's not even in my fucking name. Right now, your tags will be due July 31st. Come get this shit. You only did this to show face. If Rob did not rant about anything, I wouldn't even know that he put $10,000 down on the car. You've never given me a shopping spree, ever. I've always supported you in everything, and I've been treated like shit for 10 years already. I take your rants at 3 o'clock in the morning. I take your verbal abuse because you are my only child. But I'm a strong bitch. In this you know. So all the times you come into California. So all this time me coming to California was fake. So all this time the videos we did were fake. So all this time me consoling you after the breakups and you telling me I love you was fake. How can you be jealous of your own mother? Oh, I know exactly what it is. How can any female treat their mother like this that did absolutely nothing to them? In my book, everything will be detailed because you made me look like something I'm not. I wondered why people acted that way towards me. Even on your show, you said I intimidated people. No, I don't. I intimidate you. You're so mad that you look like me. Sorry. I wish you didn't. You're on and popping from my raisin. What you're saying, you're my mother, would curse like you? You know my mother was a Christian woman in her later years and a motherfucking real bitch in her early years. Bitch, I had to hustle drugs, pushing you in a stroller with a Glock. Bitch, if I'm so bad, why did you walk in my footsteps? Accept your selfish, ungrateful, and need Jesus, bitch. I gave you a Bible for your birthday, engraved $180. It set me back for meals, but I felt it was more important for you to have something to read than just to be out here on a limb. Guess what, little daughter? If you die today or tomorrow, your ass is in major trouble. You hang around these celebrity bitches that you know don't like you, but will not get your cousin, a aunt, a family member to be around you because your lies will then be exposed. I get it now, girlfriend. Wrong bitch. I'm still that bitch. I'm still that bitch. You know, bitch? Well, damn, bitch, okay? How many bitches can you write in a single sentence? This woman is batshit crazy, but that's not bad enough, okay? If it's not crazy enough that she went on this rant earlier today, she then decided to go on to IG Live, and she basically showed her ass, literally, okay? Yeah, she showed her ass. She went in on her daughter once again. This woman is totally off her rocker. I want you guys to go ahead and check out these videos, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. And I'm going to play all you bitches with the truth. I'm going to spill everybody. It wasn't a book like that at first. Ooh, I just finished it all last night. Oh, I'm going to show you pieces. Oh, I'm just waiting on the money. And I was like, why this bitch won't look out for mom and get the fucking book out, bitch? I ain't telling your shit like that. The fuck? Measly ass cup of cheese? Hmm, I see why. I squeezed my eyes tight to make the tears stop falling. My phone began to ring and I turned it completely off. I slung open the door of my maximum platinum. Maximum platinum, literally dragging my bags from the car in a manner of yanking them so hard until the strap popped off of my Calvin Klein luggage, making it impossible to carry. I dropped my head and took a deep breath as I stood there for 2.3 seconds to gather myself together, and then I proceeded with extreme anxiety, depression, and fear of not knowing what to do or what's going to happen next. I told myself, God will never leave you or forsake you. He is the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. God doesn't make promises he doesn't keep Tokyo. 
So I eventually pulled it together using the, all the strength that I had and stormed up the steps after receiving the motel room key. As I walked into the dark, nasty looking dim. Oh, I'm just waiting on the money. And I was like, why this bitch won't look out for mama and get the fucking book out, bitch? I ain't telling no shit like that. The fuck? Measly ass cup of cheese? Hmm, I see why. Well, China has a, uh, <laughs> I don't like that bitch, China, no more. Um, I don't know who the fuck that wicked ass motherfucker is. Ain't no kid of mine. I don't know who the fuck demon child that motherfucker is. But anyway, whatever happened to Patty? Why did not never hear about Patty's funeral? Here's my hand to the savior, all my kids, grandkids, everything. I would have went to Patty's funeral. I texted her. Begged her, please, please, China. I could catch the flight. A jet blue. I only have like four hundred dollars both ways, so I can go to Patty's funeral. Please, China. Beg her. I ain't talking about that. I'm gonna tell you about your motherfucking niece, man. Oh, what you do now? What you do now? <laughs> she yeah. told people I don't take care of her. My mother raised her. Mm -hmm. I hope you really get what the fuck I'm saying. Because y'all some lost people out here. Including my daughter. Totally lost. Lost in the motherfucking sauce. Don't know your ass from your motherfucking appetites. I really feel sorry for you people. Yeah, you are very clueless as to truly what's really going on out this motherfucker. Facts. The Bible, eh, prayer changes things when you mean it. That's it. That's 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 a true but not true statement. I'm a witness. Tra prayer can change things. It does not change things. It can. <laughs> Alright, so you guys just saw those videos. Like I said, this entire situation is a hot damn mess. Now, I know a lot of people were asking me, you know, they're like, who's Patty? People were tagging me. Who is she talking about? Who's this Patty lady? If you guys don't know, Black China had a nanny and her name was Patty. And she used to help take care of Dream and Tyga. And she had some type of hemorrhaging on the brain. And she had been in the hospital for months. They had even started up a GoFundMe for her. Rob Kardashian donated like $10,000. 
Tiger donated, I believe, a few thousand dollars. Black China was really behind this GoFundMe. They were able to raise some money for her hospital bills. But unfortunately, back in May, the woman ended up passing, okay? And that's why Teriyaki Tina is saying that she's mad that Black China wouldn't give her any money to come to Patty's funeral because she knew Patty as well, okay? But here's the true tea. Patty's husband, okay, and the family members of Patty, they are now suing Black China. She's going to have to go to court behind this woman's death because her family members are blaming Black China, saying that she abused Patty and that she didn't give her any type of workman's comp and that she stressed her out so much that she had a brain hemorrhaging. Me personally, I don't think they have a case because you know when you take on a job as a nanny, it doesn't come with like insurance and workman's comp. That's the point. You know what I'm saying? If you want those type of benefits, you have to get a different type of job they're trying to sue her teriyaki tina knows this and she's literally blasting her daughter throwing her under the bus knowing that they could use that video where she's talking bad about black china and the whole patty situation they can use that video in a court of law and they could use that against black china like look your mom is even dissing you look how bad your mom is talking about you if you can abuse your mom and get into it with your mom like this Who's to say that you weren't abusing my wife? They can use all of this when they go to court later on this year. So Teriyaki Tina is very, very devious for that. She's very foul for even bringing up the whole Patty situation. Like I told you guys in videos before, this woman is mad because Black China is not taking care of her, okay? She already made that known when I talked about the whole Teriyaki Tina and Amber Rose situation. She's mad that she never moved her into her home in Cali and took care of her. She feels like her daughter should just look out for her. Her. she shouldn't want for nothing which is funny because black china says her mom wasn't even the one who raised her, it was her grandmother and of course she has her brother on the phone and they're going back and forth and they're dissing china you know this entire situation is a mess and it's really sad that this woman is continuously blasting her daughter i feel like one of the main reasons why black china don't fuck with her is because her mom is fucking embarrassing okay this is the same woman who was washing her fucking pussy on instagram and trying to sell the damn washcloth for five hundred dollars where the hell they do that at? Go ahead and check out this video. Five hundred. I just washed my pussy with this. So if any of y'all want to go, I'm going I'm to wash it with it. <coughs> I'm going to bag it up. If, I'm going to let you see. I'm going to get your address, your name, after you send me my money. You're going to go with me the whole way. I'm going to let you see me wash my pussy with it. Not actually wash it, but you'll know. And then I'm going to wring it out, put it in a plastic bag. I'm going to put it in a plastic bag. And then I'm putting in a little red thing that I be sending my my um my uh, oils and stuff in a little cute little red little little delivery thing. And I'm gonna put it in there. And I'm gonna let you see me do it the whole time, so you don't think I switch rags. So I'm gonna let y'all buy this motherfucker. STD walking asshole at 5:30 in the morning. You watching me? You're so encouraging. <laughs> All right, so you guys just saw that damn video of her, you know what I'm saying, washing her damn coochie and trying to sell the washcloth. This woman has serious issues, okay? Not only is she on the gram while and out, going on rants, she's on the gram shaking her ass, popping her pussy, you know what I mean? How about you take all that money that them girls was throwing on your fucking pussy when you had your legs spread out? How about you take all that money and go sit the fuck down somewhere? Black China does not owe you anything, okay? She doesn't owe you shit. And that's the problem. This woman feels entitled to her daughter's lifestyle. She feels entitled to what her daughter has created for herself. And at this point in time, this shit is just getting tiresome. At this point in time, Teriyaki Tina and all her antics, she's going to make the next episode of I Don't Give a Shit News. And it's obvious that Black China no longer gives a shit about her ass either because she's not responding to her. She's not fucking with her. She's not paying her ass no mind. All she's doing is making herself look worse and worse in this situation. It's clearly obvious that this woman has some type of mental disorder. There's something mentally wrong with her. And I'm sure she'll see this video. She'll cuss me out again like she always does on the gram. I don't give a flying fuck, Teriyaki Tina, because like I told your ass before, you love to run your mouth, state your opinion about everything under the sun, and then when people talk about your ass, you get in your feelings. Get the fuck out of here tagging me in your shit, okay? Thank you. Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire situation of Tokyo Tony, aka Teriyaki Tina, once again dragging her daughter for the filth on social media. Let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. All right, deuces.
Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.